Hey guys, it's Bryce here with yet another quick tip on how to import a file created in the T-Splines plugin inside Rhino. As many of you may know, Autodesk owns the T-Splines technology and it is seen in Rhino as a plugin. This is the same technology behind Fusion 360's freeform modeling. This driving wheel concept was created in Rhino and we want to edit this in Fusion 360 in the Sculpt workspace. Let's select the geometry and go to File, Export Selected. Make sure to choose the .tsm file type, which is located way down on this scrolling list. Now let's jump over to Fusion 360. To import the TSM file correctly, let's jump into the Sculpt workspace by clicking on the Create Form command. When in the Sculpt workspace, we get a Insert T-Spline command under the Insert dropdown. Once the T-Spline model is inserted, notice we have the same control vertices as we did in Rhino. To edit the T-Spline body, we will have to upgrade the body, which takes a second. This dialog will pop up if we try to edit this body with any of the T-Splines commands. Once this upgrade is complete, we can now edit this body just as we were able to inside Rhino using the T-Spline plugin. Now that this geometry is in Fusion 360, we can use any of the workspaces to add parametric features, renderings, cam toolpaths, or any other processes that our design team may need in the product development process. Well, that's the quick tip for today. Until next time.